Selick, your board chair for Care Providers of Minnesota. And I just want to let you know that it's been a busy last week and this week. Patty and I have been on the tour for the region meetings. Last week we started out in Duluth, went up to Erskine, and then down to Fergus Falls and finished up at Little Falls. This week, I actually today, uh, at Care Providers, uh, right at the office, and then tomorrow we're going to be in Mankato, uh, we're going to be in uh, Tracy on Thursday, and finally we're going to finish up at Rochester at Madonna Towers. A lot of good participation, and by the way, one of the things I want to mention is, I'll go over briefly what we've talked about, but when those schedules come out, sometimes it's hard for you to make the region meeting that you're closest to. Please keep in mind, you can go to any region meeting. Your input is extremely important. Um, in addition to Patty and I, we've also had the uh, Department of Human Services there with Gene Wood and Lisa Rodegaard. They've been going over a lot of the home and community-based services, uh, transition plan, a lot of good information, a lot of great questions. One thing I picked up on that was that it's taken CMS five years to come up with this plan. It's, they still don't have a lot of guidance, which means there's a lot of questions. You are the expert. You do this all the time. Please let Lisa and Jean know what your questions are, what your information is, because then they can take that back to CMS. That's going to help you in the end because Minnesota is different. We know that, and you are the expert. We also went over uh, what the legislative session was like this year. The unsession, but there was a lot of information that was gone over. We also had reviewed legislative uh, advocacy and also the association strategic activities. One of the things I want to point out is when it comes to legislative updates, it was very brief in the uh, uh, region meetings. However, I encourage you to sign up for the webinar on June 26th for the uh, uh, le legislative update. And uh, it's going to be great, a lot of good information, a lot more detail than what we go over in the meeting. And also on June, July 22nd, we have a fun Razor golf tournament. It's fun because you get out with a lot of your peers and it's to raise money for scholarships. So with that, that's a quick summary of what's been happening, what's been going on last week, this week, and if you ever have any questions, please contact the association staff. And remember, on the bottom of the action, there's always the calendar of upcoming events. So until next time, we'll see you later. Bye.